My name is Rhonda Miller, and I am the founder and executive director of the nonprofit Speak Up for Ben, as well as the flagship project of the nonprofit, the Oasis Community Center. Ben was so much fun. Growing up, he was full of energy, full of excitement and enthusiasm. He was just filled with joy. He was really a happy young person. He was very creative. He was um, a musician, a self-taught musician. He produced his own music, and he was very proud of that accomplishment. So my son Ben was prescribed opioids for the first time just after his 17th birthday when he had his wisdom teeth removal. And very tragically, we lost him at the age of 23, four and a half years ago, to fentanyl poisoning. We established Speak Up For Ben um, as a, a way to advocate in our community and to bring education and awareness. The name Ben interestingly forms the acronym Break the Silence and the Stigma, Never Forget. I think it's really important for people who don't have experience with opioid addiction to understand that this is a situation that happens to good families. They are people that struggle with a medical condition that needs support and understanding and compassion. To parents and loved ones who have a family member that suffers with opioid use disorder, I would say there's no shame in this. This is a medical condition. I would recommend that you reach out. Don't be ashamed, don't hide in darkness. Reach out, come forward, get help. There's many support groups and there's many programs that are available today in our communities across Pennsylvania.